Obviously, we're talking about dangerously hot situations, hot temperatures here and across Texas and beyond. And that heat is not only hard on humans and animals, it takes it out of mechanical equipment too, like air conditioners. KTAB meteorologist Noel Reem has more on that. Running the AC could come with an extra fee, but there's a catch. When you sit down writing your check to pay your electric bill, go look at your air filter. You know, that's that's 65% of that bill that you just paid. In a house and in a car without air conditioner is bizarre. I would say probably 80% of the time it can be fixed within an hour. But during some circumstances, cool air could take a while to return. You start getting into motors and compressors and expansion valves and different components. You know, it can take a half a day to a full day to repair. Routine maintenance keeps the air circulating. So the best thing a homeowner could do to, you know, help themselves out is to keep that outdoor unit clean, free of grass and debris and pet hair or, or anything around it. If you prefer a DIY service cleaning, here's how. Find the power source to that outdoor unit, kill the power to that outdoor unit, and get a garden hose with a high pressure nozzle and, and go in an up and down motion. Um, flushing, the, flushing the water up and down through that coil to get all that debris and grass and pet hair and stuff off that outdoor coil. This time of year, it's hard for an AC unit to freeze up, but if it does, it could use some attention. Generally, if a unit's freezing up, it's not because they turned it down too cool. Um, it's not going to get cold enough in the house or cold enough outside to cause a unit to freeze up um, during this time of year. The reason one is freezing up is because it's got a mechanical problem. In Abilene, with coverage you can count on, Noel Reem, KTAB News. All right, thank you, Noel. One more thing, air conditioners circulate and filter air, removing pol uh, pollutants and mold. This is especially important for people who suffer from allergies and asthma. So keep your system clean by changing filters regularly. Otherwise, the AC can actually contribute to indoor air pollution. Good information yes, there.